I did want to also point out that this is why you want to be a little bit, you know, more stringent with, say, your Wi-Fi password. Anyone can go on the internet and find out how to break into a Wi-Fi network. For example, uh, the WEP, the old-fashioned uh, password protection from routers. If you have a very old wireless router and it still uses a WEP security system, guess what? I can break into that in 20 minutes. And I'm not going to lie, back in college, that's how I got free internet. I'm not going to say I did it, but it is something that is easily doable. Even WPA and WPA2, that's actually easily breakable. And so much so, guess what? This is the link to do it. Don't do it. Don't actually go out there and learn how to do this unless you're you know, interested in that because I don't want to get in trouble when you get arrested for breaking into wireless networks. Guess what? That's against US federal law. Federal, not just state. But that information's out there. So. One of the things you can do to bypass that and secure yourself is instead of making small passwords, make them very long. Make them easy to remember. Something like men in tight, tight tights is actually more important because it's very secure.